All right, so if we're gonna do walk arounds, might as well do my 08 E63 AMG. Gonna get rid of this one as well, probably in uh, end of August, early September. Love this car. This was my development car for the last maybe five or more years for suspension, braking, engine stuff. Uh, you guys have probably seen my kits um, and various solutions for this car that I put out over the years. Uh, the wheel and tire setup is a little more aggressive than stock, so 285 rear, 255 front, running a 219, nine and a half wheel in the rear, 18 by nines up front. Uh, those are the rears that normally go on in the E63 that I'm running on the front, just to be a little more aggressive. Uh, other than that, the vehicle is pretty much stock. Um, probably going to clean up those fogs before I sell it, get some new fog lights on there. Uh, this one's flint gray over uh, palm gray. Uh, so you got dark palm gray for the steering wheel, and you got palm gray for the interior. Uh, it's got the panel roof as well. Uh, before I sell the car, I definitely got to get these 219s color matched. Because they do the Himalaya gray uh, for the wheels on the E63s. So that's the rear of the car. Uh, it's got the sunshade. It's got the, um, the pass-through for the seats so you can fully fold them down. Excuse the FedEx truck in the background. If you go into the trunk, you basically fit a body in there. Got my um, <laughs> Milwaukee vacuum because life happens. Oh boy, life really does happen, huh? New Odyssey battery. Obviously, new trunk seal because, you know, hashtag European cars, new taillight seals. You always want to do that so you don't get water ingress causing other issues. Maybe show you a little bit more of the interior before we wrap this up. Really soft, uh, semi-aniline, semi, uh, I think it's called, leather. Uh, definitely gotta clean up those map pockets a little bit. You can see with age what happens there. Very easy fix to explain what happens there. This uh, plastic, the rod inside of the leather map pocket, it snaps. <laughs> Fun time, so we gotta repair this. This has the multi-contour seats, so the bladders, you know, inflate for lumbar, for the shoulders, thighs, etc. Got the bird's eye uh, wood. It's got the shade as well. We've got uh, in the interior, the really, uh, really the only modification here is gonna be with the Bluetooth system, uh, Bluetooth audio, and Bluetooth telephone. Had it done by Becker. And then for the pocket over here, converted it to a storage pocket uh, instead of the six disc CD, because I can't remember the last time I touched the CD. But definitely gotta clean up the interior. You can see a little bit of dirt on the mat, so it needs to be vacuumed. Uh, but this leather is still really soft, really nice. Love the Alcantara inserts on these. Um, last thing I wanna do, let's go under the hood. I'll show you what's going on there really quick. Coming up on three minutes. Let's just get that fully open. Oh, boy. All right. Um, so you guys know I've done a lot with this engine over the years to develop products, like I mentioned earlier. So new coolant reservoir, new water pump, new thermostat. Thermostat video is pretty popular. New belts, pulleys. Oh God, what else? Intake manifold reseal. Uh, head bolts upgrade, all kinds of stuff. So yeah, it's um is in really good shape. Uh, probably forgetting a million things that I've done over the years. But um, but that's about it. That that about wraps it up for this E63 AMG. Just kind of letting you guys know what to expect going forward. You've already seen my video in the queue for the uh, the E350 over there. That's the development car that we use that we're trying to get rid of. And then my personal car. It's time to get into something else. And I'm really excited for whoever, you know, grabs this one. This one's been great to me. I'm about to go up north with it. Nice two-hour drive for the weekend. Leave any questions in the comments.